Hey guys, Royal Heart here. I know this is probably not the video you guys would think would come out for my first time back on the new account, but it's something that has to be addressed because I am part of the My Little Pony fandom. I am a Pegasus sister and I have other Pegasus sisters and bronies as my friends and I watch a lot of the my Little Pony reviewers and everything, and I know this has already been covered by a lot of people already in the community, but I just thought I'd give my little opinion on it. This is my statements and my thoughts on Toon Critic Y2K. I have... I've been in the fandom... Hmm, pretty much since it began just not subscribed to many YouTubers um, early on. I am subscribed to a lot of them. I like Dr. Wolf and Lightning Bliss and Wilstonator and a few others. I was subscribed to Toon Critic before everything had happened with him and Apparently, everybody found out way before me, because apparently, like Josh said, it was leaked. It somehow got leaked. I don't know how it got leaked, but I apparently was the last to find out about everything, because I don't get on YouTube very often. But when I found out, it hit hard. I looked up to and admired Toon really, really much. I would look to him for inspiration. I'd look to him to make me laugh. I looked to uh, a bunch of others like Lightning and Doc to make me laugh. The like the My Little Pony D and D sessions that go on right now, they really cheer me up a lot lately. And when I found out about Toon, it just my world kind of came to a halt and kind of crashed. I was like, uh, "How how does this happen to to someone that you really admire and care about?" It's like, I, I don't know what to say about it. It was a big shocker to everybody, I am sure you, and I know that everything's being taken care of now, and I, I really hope he gets the help he needs for what had happened. And uh, I know all of his social medias are gone, like gone, gone. Other than I think his Twitch and his Patreon, which I don't think he'll probably get very many people there either. Or he's probably taken them down by now as well. But it's just a big shock to see someone that you more or less idolized do something like that. You would never think that somebody would ever do that. But then when someone does, it kind of just makes your whole world freeze and come to a halting crash. There's not much to say on the matter. I mean, a, a lot of other people has already said what has, could possibly be said about it. The Wilstonator, uh, Doc, Lightning, and uh, Voice of Reason and Sega. You, They've already voiced their complaints and Will's wife, Katie. I'm bad with names, so if I forgot any names, I'm sorry. It's just... 
I know it hurt all of them. And I know it's probably hurt a lot of a lot of the people who followed him. And I just thought I'd voice how I feel about everything and get it out of the way. I, for one, don't per like. I know I know no one likes it, but I just feel bad now that I know what has happened happened and. I know there's nothing we can do about it, but it's over with now. I hope he's getting all the help he needs. And I hope that him and his family can make it through everything that's going on and go from there. See what happens. Who knows? Maybe, maybe he'll come back. I don't know. Honestly, I know a lot of people probably don't want to even fool him now, but you never know. So, so much for having a good first video. <laughs> but anyway, I thought I'd share my opinions on Tune and just get it out of the way. That way I can follow everything up with happy stuff. I thought, hey, today was already a bad day. Let's just go ahead and get the bad video out of the way. So, that's the end of this little discussion. I'll see you guys next time when and if I figure out what the heck I'm going to do. Um, so yeah, this has been Royal Heart, and remember to always follow your heart. Bye, guys.